This is KISS FM, and good morning. How you doing? Hope you're doing very well. Now, on the line, as promised, I told you we were going to get her, and we have her live on the air, Nini Upalori. How you doing? Hi, thank you so much for having me. I'm doing well. Hope you're doing well, too. Oh, I am doing very well. First of all, I want to say congratulations, little brother and shattered and and your music is absolutely phenomenal. Thank you. I'm flattered. <laughs> <laughs> now, you are so young and have such a beautiful voice. Tell everybody, how did you get started? Okay, so really I started like, you know, when I was like two, I used to like hum and sing. But really my interest for music and passion grew like during 2021, I think. Like when during COVID lockdown, I was just really bored and I thought I would use the time to improve myself. And that's when my interest for music really grew. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you definitely got it down, Pat. Uh, you know, your voice is so beautiful. You said have such a large voice. Is that something that was inherited? Are other members of your family blessed with that kind of talent? Kind of a mix of, well, obviously I am firstly thankful to God, but because it kind of comes a little bit easier to me. But it is also a mix because, like, I had ha I have had um, professional training from a vocal coach in NYC. Yeah, for like two years, I would say. You've actually had training as well. Yeah. Oh man, that is great. Well, you know, like I said, you could definitely tell talent. Uh, obviously, legendary people like Michael Jackson. Michael started when he was real young, and his voice was just so phenomenal and and i see the same thing with you thank you so much <laughs> you have the, the song little brother how oh, yeah, yeah I, I, how exactly did that come to pass honestly you know i wanted to make it based on my experiences with my little brother and you know i also have some cousins who have had same like similar experiences with their little brother and i was really inspired by that idea and i kind of want i kind of wanted to make a song about my little brother so yeah great song people have called up about it and the biggest thing that they had wanted to know was who is nini you know who is this this phenomenal artist that we have and, and are currently hearing do you play any instruments yourself yeah um i am i'm like i'm not a pro like but i am learning guitar and piano and yeah i'm currently learning them and yeah i use them to compose my music does writing come natural to you yeah i'm right now writing you know kind of it comes naturally to me sometimes i do some spend like you know a lot of time on it but yeah it's kind of a mix and you know it takes time to kind of change make changes and you know come up with an idea for a song what inspires you to come up with the song like the writing process something where you know you're at school or you're all of a sudden you will think of a theme or an idea does it just naturally come to you or do you actually sit down with the writing process and you know plan it out Usually it's just like I get inspired by events that I have personally experienced in the past in my life or, you know, experiences of other people around me, like my friends, family. And if it really, like, you know, touches me, then I try to make a song about it, come up with some ideas, and yeah. You know, that is the uh, the mark of greatness there. You know, uh, I remember talking to a, a legendary artist, and he said that just out of the blue, he can write a song from other people's experiences, or if something comes to mind, he'll jot it on down. Are yeah. you the same way? Yeah, but, you know, I'm only 12. But I try my best. Um, for Little Brother, I actually, you know, did the song and like it took half a day to make the melody and the lyrics. But that was, but that was an exception because a lot of the other songs take a bunch of time to think about. <laughs> you know, to be 12 years old, you're so amazing, and your you music know, is ah, uh, it is just so inspiring. And you know, Little Brother is just one of the songs. Now, how did you come up with Shattered? Yeah, it was kind of like you know my best friends. You know, I was like. I had like a, I had like two best friends who I thought were my best friends because they really weren't and I was really upset after like we ended the friendship 
And yeah, she was like literally a fake friend. And yeah, I just was really upset about that. But I thought, let me make a song out of it, you know? Think about it. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what inspired me to make Shattered. <laughs> that is truly the definition of taking lemons and making good lemonade out of it. Who are your favorite artists? What artists that you look up to and that is your favorite? Oh, like Taylor Swift, Olivia Rodrigo, um, Katy Perry, if you want to go back, you know, more in time, like Billy Joel and Sammy Davis Jr. I'm sure there's many other folks I listen to out there that I can't really think of at the moment. Mm-hmm. Uh, ooh, Megan Trainer is one. Um, but yeah, ooh yeah, sometimes I listen, I, I listen to some of the songs too. <laughs> you want well, you're right up there as far as talent, you know, the Miley Cyrus and everything. And I'm definitely a Taylor Swift fan. She is phenomenal. And hearing your music, I would say you are right up there with her. Thank you. Yeah. So much. <laughs> and to be so young and to have so much talent, you definitely are taking the music world afire. Now, what else would you like to do? Obviously, to record more music, but would you like to do films or other creative projects as well? Um, you know, maybe da- I'm not kind of, I'm kind of open-minded. Maybe dance a little bit in the future. Ooh, yeah. I'm I'm kind of open minded maybe act you know learn a bit of acting i'm just open minded at the moment i'm only 12 <laughs> that is a great thing because you have so much uh, ahead of you and so much talent and you know so many opportunities by the way uh your your dad your dad is your manager right yeah, he, you know, gets in contact with, you know, music producers, all that, basically. Well, tell your dad he's done a fine job. He is a, a great guy, and he is <laughs> definitely... Thank you so much. He, he is, is definitely, definitely doing it. I really, really, really appreciate that. <laughs> I'm sure he's going to be glad to hear that, you know? <laughs> is, is there a fan club or anything else like that? Take your time and tell people how they can get in touch with you. Yeah, so you guys can listen to my music. They're available. It's available on Spotify, all major online streaming platforms like Spotify, SoundCloud, uh, YouTube Music, um, Apple Music, iTunes. It's every uh, all, all major streaming platforms, basically. Which means you can find her. And you can get in touch with me on YouTube as well. Some lyrical videos on there. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's on my YouTube channel. Spell your name, and so that way people can definitely tune in. Um, and one more thing I wanted to mention. I do not have Instagram or Facebook, unfortunately, yet. I'm only 12, so mm-hmm. I have to be minimum 13 before. But hopefully when I'm 13 soon, um, in March, actually, this year, I can have um, an Instagram and Facebook and, you know, connect with more people. That is so good. Yeah, and that's understandable, you know, because you are young and we still have to be, you know, safe and obviously you know the platforms they have their rules and regulations and we and we don't want to yeah go go past that but what other songs do you have an ep out as well yeah got an ep out <laughs> <laughs> so name some of the other songs that you have on the ep yeah the ep is actually you know it's there but like it's also in the process because I, I have a few more songs coming up but yeah oh great now, so that means we can look forward to more music. Yeah, yeah, this week, next week, having some more music. That is great. You definitely have to share it with us because we are fans over here. <laughs> thank you so much. I appreciate it. Just say once again, just say thank you and congratulations on all your success. Obviously, you know, when you get your first Grammy and your second Grammy and when you get your American Music Awards and all that, please remember us little people over here, this little bitty radio so station. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. You're so kind. You just can't explain how much your words mean to me. Oh, <laughs> well, we are definitely impressed, and we just really want to say thank you. Um, I you guess. Oh, yeah. You know, there are there are kids and other young adults and people that are listening right now. And they're saying to themselves, I want to be where Nini is. I want to be doing what she does. What advice would you give to your fellow up and coming younger musicians and vocalists for them to get their music out? What advice would you give them? I think it's just 
you know, guys, believe in yourself. You can do it, I promise, with hard work and dedication and, and, and discipline and patience. And consistently, you can get to where you want to get to. I promise, and I believe in you. Just never give up. You can do it. Well said. Well said. And on that note, I am going to close it out. Me for any mistakes. Um, this is my first inter- interview, if you already didn't tell. Oh, are you kidding? You <laughs> sound like a pro. Matter of fact, I think we might have made more mistakes than you have. Oh, thank you. Uh, no, don't <laughs> you, you guys are good. <laughs> well, Nene, I want to say thank you so much. And you are obviously awesome. And hey, you know, hopefully we can do this again. Yeah, I would love to do that again. Um, thank you so much for having me. I'm really glad to be here. All right. Well, you have a good one, okay? Yeah, you too. Have a great one. <laughs> love you all. And she loves you all. Couldn't do it without you all your support and your you guys are my inspiration i love that i absolutely love that all right nini thank you so much and we will be talking again thank you i'm excited hi this is nini Bluey, and i have my song shattered on kiss fm 104.7 you wore me like smiles like a summer Now I'm picking up pieces Don't know where
This is KISS FM, and good morning. How you doing? Hope you're doing very well. Now, on the line, as promised, I told you we were going to get her, and we have her live on the air, Nini Upalori. How you doing?